In the late 1980s, a corporate security specialist from the US named Rick Rescorla claimed that a spot in the basement of the World Trade Center was vulnerable to attack and needed more security. His recommendations were promptly ignored. But in 1993, terrorists used the bomb to blow up part of the North Tower, merely 30 feet from the location he had identified. Afterwards, Rick gained a bit more authority and eventually became the head of security for a section of the Twin Towers. However, he was incredibly worried that another attack on the towers would occur, and when his pleas to move employees failed, Rick developed his own evacuation plan and required everyone in his section to constantly practice it. People were probably annoyed at him for it. But then came September 11, 2001. When the first plane hit the North Tower, it was announced that everyone in Rick's South Tower should stay calm and remain seated. Rick, however, immediately began ordering everyone to evacuate the building. Nearly all the employees under Rick quickly made it outside with him. Rick himself was last seen running back into the building to look for those who had been left behind. But shortly afterwards, the South Tower would come crashing down, with him still inside. He was credited with saving nearly 2,700 lives, and all but six of the people he was in charge of survived the attack.